Narrated by Abu Masud The Prophet peace be upon him prohibited taking the price of a dog, the earnings of a soothsayer and the money earned by prostitution. Narrated by Abu Juhayfa The Prophet peace be upon him cursed the lady who practices tattooing and the one who gets herself tattooed, and one who eats, takes, riba, usury, and the one who gives it. And he prohibited taking the price of a dog, and the money earned by prostitution, and cursed the makers of pictures. Narrated by Abu Huraira The Prophet peace be upon him forbade taking the earnings of a slave girl by prostitution. Narrated by Sa'id bin Jubair I said to Ibn Umar, if a man accuses his wife of illegal sexual intercourse, what is the judgment? He said, Allah's Prophet separated the couple of Baniyaj Lan, when the husband accused his wife for an illegal sexual intercourse. The Prophet peace be upon him said, Allah knows that one of you two is a liar, so will one of you repent. But they refused. He then again said, Allah knows that one of you two is a liar, so will one of you repent. But they refused, whereupon he separated them by divorce. Ayyub, a subnarrator, said, Amor bin Dinar said to me, in the narration there is something which I do not see you mentioning, the husband said, what about my money, Mar? The Prophet peace be upon him said, you are not entitled to take back money, for if you told the truth you have already entered upon her, and consummated your marriage with her, and if you are a liar then you are less entitled to take it back. Narrated by Ibn Umar the Prophet peace be upon him said to those who were involved in a case of Lian, Your accounts are with Allah. One of you two is a liar. You, husband, have right on her wife. The husband said, My money, O Allah's apostle. The Prophet peace be upon him said, You are not entitled to take back any money. If you have told the truth, the mar that you paid, was for having sexual relations with her lawfully, and if you are a liar, then you are less entitled to get it back.